was a clear agreement on what he would pay. And she agreed that she would pay most of the money, apparently, because you I were didn't agree. I had no choice. This man was going to starve in Puerto Rico. Like. Okay, well, you... And therefore, and, and therefore, you decided to take him. It was a bad idea to, to, to go on the trip. He didn't have all the money, so here's what I'm going to do. To the $3,000 that this trip clearly cost, no one's disputing that. The question is, who owes what? And rather than look at every single receipt or text message, etc., that's no way to divide a relationship. You had a trip. You're not getting a free trip out of this. So 1000 to recover the 3000 that was paid, 1000 I will give you, the plaintiff, on your suit for that part. On the lawsuit regarding the phone payments, the records are so screwed up, but I will make him pay that 107 So I find for the plaintiff in the sum of $1,107. I'm actually going to donate that thousand dollars to your cause. You're going to need it. This is not for evidence from, you know, both sides from their mouth. I'm just happy where I feel like I said to pay the full amount, but that's not why I can't fight the rest of it. So I'm just, you know, going with the treatment. I'm glad that it's over and done with. I want that man to get out of my life. I don't want to think about him anymore. It's been a year since we've seen each other since this moment, so it's just going to continue just to stay away from each other, no communication. Everything about that relationship was a whole regret. I was a sugar mama at 23 years old. Not a lot of people can say that.